We now have confirmation that the Federal Reserve will start winding back its COVID-19 stimulus package. The Fed says it will soon start tapering its massive bond buying program that kept the American economy afloat throughout the pandemic. Kim Yonsun with the details. The U.S. Federal Reserve will start dialing back its enormous COVID-19 stimulus program. It will likely start from mid-November, marking the Fed's first major pullback since the program was launched in March 2020, after the pandemic chilled the U.S. economy and slammed the employment market. The Fed froze interest rates at near zero and began buying 120 billion U.S. dollars worth of treasury and mortgage-backed securities each month. For a year and a half, this aggressive tactic helped pin down long-term rates and made borrowing easier, giving the pandemic-ridden U.S. economy the leg up it needed. The Fed's announcement on Wednesday said it will start cutting 15 billion U.S. dollars a month from the bond buying program. Interest rates, however, will remain the same for now. Our decision today to begin our tapering our asset purchases didn't, does not imply any direct signal regarding our interest rate policy. The Fed said the time is right for tapering, thanks to the substantial progress the U.S. economy had made toward reaching maximum employment and inflation that averages around 2 percent. The Fed is also forecasting the U.S. economy to pick up steam as COVID-19 vaccinations continue across the country. But despite the injection of optimism, many uncertainties remain, including inflation that has spiked in the U.S. due to soaring demand and a supply squeeze. This has kept prices inflated longer than central bankers had expected. But if the American economy manages to meet the Federal Reserve's expectations, the Fed said it will make similar reductions each month and wrap up the program entirely by June 2022. Kim Yonsung, Arirang News.